That ain't for me. Just <laughs> FYI, yeah. <laughs> It's a celebration of pop culture and it's all happening this weekend at Crypticon Minneapolis from movies and TV to anime and sci fi fans will be out in full force meeting some famous faces attending panels and celebrating some of their favorite pop culture uh, milestones. Joining me today are two of the famous faces in attendance this weekend. Give it up for actress, author and spiritual healer D, D Wallace and actor Danny Pintaro. Everybody. <laughs> Thank you to both of you. You guys are touchstones for me, and I appreciate it very much. I want to start with this. Uh, this is going to be a blast from the past. Uh oh. Uh, oh. I I've been doing this since God was in diapers, and uh, this <laughs> is from 2000. D and I have actually met before. Oh at no. D opened a theater around here because she's a big deal. And I, they sent me, I'm like 12 years old, and they sent me to interview you. Here it is at the I AMC Theater, Eden Prairie, in 2002. Oh That's it, look God. at this. D, look at this! Look at me, D! Oh my God. I, I got done with my shift at Target and then went right to the shoot. I did. I worked the garden center at Target and then interviewed D. That's what I did. Oh, wow. Look at us, D. Right? Oh my I, goodness. I think we look better now. I do too! <laughs> I do too! Danny, what is this? Like you, I was gonna, uh, I wanna talk about, you do so well, you connect so well with fans on TikTok, mm. but these cons, <laughs> These cons over the last decade, 15 years, have just exploded. What is it like for you to connect with fans in this way? It, 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 there's nothing better. And we reconnected through the conventions because yeah. we, we hadn't really lost touch, but uh, the first convention, it was like 10 years ago, we saw each other and it just, and now I get to see her at least two or three times a year and reconnect and love. But the fans are just so gracious and so happy that we're there. Yeah. And we just it's have such a, a good time. It's a love fest. Yeah. yeah. It really is a love fest. Yeah. You spend all day giving a lot of love and getting a lot of love back and there's nothing Yeah. Bad. Because I use, I, it wasn't an accident that I used the word touchstone. I bet it touches you when people tell you you're a part of my childhood. You were part that yes. must that's like a heart print for you, I would imagine. Yeah, everybody's grown up on me. <laughs> 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 and you've grown up in front of everybody. <laughs> exactly, yeah. yes. But this, this is a different type of, of connection because they're right there in front of mm -hmm. you. They can tell your stories. And I just, it's just a hell of a lot of fun, I would imagine. Yeah, it, there's a lot of hugs, sometimes tears, yeah. a lot of laughter. A lot of laughs. It's just a, a love fest. When did you, I, I read in the, when we, I was reading the intro there, spirit, spiritual healer, when did that happen? Was that after you saw me in the Target outfit? I mean, yeah. <laughs> I needed to save myself somehow. Okay. <laughs> um, I, I have been a spiritual healer for 35 years. Really? I have six books out on it. Yeah. My last one is Born, Giving Birth to a New You, and it is the formula for creating anything in your life. And Danny will tell you, yeah, absolutely. I'm a pretty darn good creator. <laughs> <laughs> There's the book, everyone. Oh, thank you. Oh, I love there that. Is, that is fantastic. That's a different level of joy, I would imagine, for you. Totally. Um, but it's all love, you know? People don't understand how powerful love is in creating anything you want. Basically, whatever you want, Love it more. Yeah. Love and don't we, more. we need to hear that a lot yeah. nowadays. Yeah, we oh, do. Yeah. Because there's so much negativity and we just seem to be at odds with each other. So that seems like a very general thing to say, but it's just fundamentally true. But, fundamentally. Yeah. Look, you can't be in love and be in judgment at the same mm. time. Oh, I like, oh. And that's. That was a little moment for the audience. And I, that was, yeah. And that's brain science. Your brain cannot hold two points of interest at the same time. Mm. So you either go on social media <laughs> to spread love or you go on to judge. And I think we have enough judgment in the world. Yes. Okay. Well, that leads me. Danny, you know, a compliment to you because it's, it's, it, you led me, helped me perfectly lead into what I was gonna ask Danny. You're so good 
at TikTok. You're so, <laughs> no, and I mean that. I, it sounds you. flip, but you're so good. You really, our executive producer, Jeff, is like, I watched Danny last night. You know what I mean? <laughs> you know, what is that? What, that? It has power to it. It does. Social media has become a whole other ball game. And when I decided to be an actor again, al almost two years ago now, I realized just how important. And I said to myself, I'm not going to let someone who has a, a bigger profile on social media get the job over me. So I just made a conscious effort. And you just have to have a good time. Yeah. And you just have to Fun. be yourself. And you just have to speak to the people out there and uh, make them laugh. I mean, at least I do a lot of live TikToks where people chat with me and I, I, I have this giggle and everyone just says it's so infectious. So you just want to be there and create a safe space. You know, I love it. It's really fun. He's my little boy. <laughs> <laughs> Is it it's probably like a safe, not a, not a safety net, but I bet it's just, it's, it's, um, comforting to look across the table at an event like this and see someone that you have a genuine connection with. Yes, and my purpose every day is to get up and have a love connection with everybody. Yeah, well, everybody. I appreciate like you. you. Yeah, I, it, it meant the world that you guys were here and I just thank you very much. I really appreciate oh, it very much. You. Give it up everybody, D. Wallace and Danny Pintaro, thank you. Crypticon Minnesota starts today and runs through Sunday. For a full schedule and tickets, head to CrypticonMinneapolis.com. And if you're watching us from our other cities, look for a con and look for them. We'll be right back. Back in a moment, everybody. That's it. That's it, yeah. Thank you. We're going to do a